Yo ho, what's up guys? So I've just taken a look at all of the new units and guess what guys? There is some prize some surprises like some godlies that are better than ultimate units. Look at this guys. That's crazy. Bro, Admiral Kaidu is crying right now. That's all I'm saying, guys. He is crying right now. So let's go rank all of the new units as well as update our ultimate tower defense tier list. Here we go, boys. Let's get it. So first up, here are all the new units in the update. All right, we got the two godlies and all the event units. And then, of course, guys, the secret event unit. So first up, a few things I've noted. All right, young Sasuke sucks. All right, I'm dropping him down a tier. Also, a few adjustments. Fleet Admiral Kainu, I am moving him down to... I'm just going to move him down to A tier, guys. I think he's mid. All right, I'm not going to lie, guys. I think he's mid. And uh, honestly, I think it's time for us to move a couple of these guys down as well. I'm going to be honest, guys. Naruto. Ooh, Whis. Ooh. Maybe like C tier. Like, it, it's not looking good, guys. All right. I, I'm going to be honest. We are shaking up the tier list quite a lot here. All right. These guys all suck, too. These guys. Honestly, Admiral Kazaru, like. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know, man. I'm going I'm to give him A tier. But, like, it, it's not looking good, guys. I'm not going to lie. These, these new units are pretty banging. All right. First up, guys, we got the new Boros. All right, so the new Boros, there's actually three versions, all right? They get, like, progressively better, but the first Boros, he's probably going to be a solid A-tier unit. All right, very, very good unit here. All right, next up, we got, um, uh, like, the new weird event units. They're kind of weird units to rank, I'd say, but honestly, they're as good as, like, the ultimates. So I'd probably put these two guys, like, here. Honestly, they're here, and then this guy probably here. All right, actually, no, I wanted it to be like this, and then I don't, I don't know. Yeah, this is probably better. All right, perfect. All right, and then let's see here. The next Boros is definitely, I would say, slightly better. Um, I think a Kainu is technically still better, but I think he's a little bit better. And then I'd say, like, the big boy Boros, I would say he's really good for classic farming. Now, Colossal Titan, I don't think he's as good for Colossal, I mean, for gold farming anymore. Um, honestly, I think he's probably deserves A tier nowadays. And Whitebeard, honestly, guys, he's actually really, really good now. Um, especially if you prestige him a little bit, he can do some serious damage. Now, Balma, oh my gosh. I'm going to be honest, Balma, Balma's popping off. I think I'm gonna move Bulma up to the S tier, especially if you get it to like Divine or anything better than that. She is cracked. Yeah, and Power, I don't think Power is that good anymore. I think Power is probably right about here on the list. All right, and honestly, I think, yeah, I think this is probably way more fair. All right. So uh, next up we have the two new godlies, which are cracked. Now Sasuke is actually meta. All right, Sasuke is a meta burn unit, which is pretty OP. So uh, I'm putting Sasuke into the S plus tier easily. All right, I definitely recommend you guys get your hands on Sasuke as soon as possible. Um, he basically is literally 100% better than Akainu. All right, let me go show you that right now. So look at his stats, guys. You can place three of them, all right, three of them. So that's the equivalent of 90,000 damage for a three SPA. This guy's a 2.9 SPA and five. So no matter how you look at it, guys, Akainu is dumb. Honestly, I might just sacrifice him because he's literally that trash, guys. So uh, F in the chat for a lot of the ultimates. Um, I would say, like, they're just not that good compared to even the new godlies. Naruto, I like Naruto a lot. I think he's really, really good for gold farming. I'm going to be honest. I think he might even... He's up there. All right. <coughs> I think he's probably one of the better units for gold farming. Um... Now, honestly, I think I might even move some of these guys up. Maybe a little bit. Okay. Mel's might honestly be close to S tier. But uh, I'll put him in B tier for now. But he's still a really, really good... I don't know, man. He's close. Honestly, I'd probably say... I think A tier might be more fair for him. Um, let me go compare his stats real quick to some of these other guys. All right. He is a double placement. So, uh, 70k... And then for 3.3, and then we have Mel's, and Mel's is, wow, 115 for four. 
That's limited plus though. 125. Yeah, that's actually kind of a little bit better. So I definitely think he's probably one of the better ones up there. Now Miriam, I think is actually burned now too. So I think Miriam might deserve low A tier. All right, you could probably still use Miriam for infinite mode. Um, as far as these units go, I think it's time to move a few of these guys down a little bit. Um, yeah, these guys just do not cut the mustard whatsoever. All right, these are like the D tier godlies here. Um, so there you go, guys. I think that's fair for the new tier list. Let me know what you guys think about it, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.